Hey there, this is Ruben Lerner. I am super excited to be putting the finishing touches on a weekly Python exercise newbie edition. This is a new course, and it comes from repeated requests that I had from people who wanted to enroll in the regular edition of weekly Python exercise, but weren't totally familiar with the language yet. They were newbies, they were newcomers. They had maybe been working with Python for a few months, or maybe took a course or tutorial, and they understand the basics, basically, but they really want to reinforce those core data structures and the writing of functions and the using of some basic standard library modules before going on to the more advanced stuff that I cover in Weekly Python Exercise. So Weekly Python Exercise Newbie Edition is meant for you if you're an experienced programmer in another language and you love to just jump right in and learn a new language through exercises and challenges. It's for you if, as I've said, you've been working with Python for a while, and yet every day you find yourself going to Stack Overflow a dozen times because you can't remember which parentheses, square brackets, round parentheses, curly braces used to extract records from a dictionary, or how exactly it is that you can do a list of lists, or how exactly you break a string into a list of strings. We're going to talk about that and more. Every week you're going to get a new exercise along with a list of topics that are covered by the exercise and some resources to know which tools you can and should be using in order to solve it. Then, together with other people on the forum, you can talk about it. You can discuss your potential solutions. You can find out where your strengths and your weaknesses are and build up on your strengths and conquer those weaknesses. And then, after you get the exercise on Tuesday and talk about it for a week, the following Monday you get my solution with long detailed explanations of how I would have approached it, and maybe some alternative explanations that I rejected. In many cases, I will be including uh, automated tests using PyTests. Not every exercise, especially at the beginning, will lend itself to that. I'm going to try to build up uh, in complexity as the course goes on. Also, about once a month, I'll be holding office hours. So if you want to come and chat about uh, the exercises, about Python questions you have, you are more than welcome to do that. I've been teaching Python for more than 20 years, and every year I'm convinced more and more that the only way to really achieve Python fluency is through exercises, through experiment, through what I call controlled frustration. Can you solve problems, not in your work context, but in a context that's designed to help you to learn? And the best way to do that, as far as I'm concerned, is weekly Python exercise. I really, as I said, am excited about launching this new one for newbies. I hope that you're excited also. And uh, I invite you to join me in this new course when it starts in early January. Don't wait to sign up, because if you miss the deadline, if you miss January 3rd, well, you'll have to wait until the next time that I offer it, later in 2019. If you have questions, contact me. Don't hesitate to send me an email, Ruben at Learner CIL. I love hearing from people. I want to hear what questions you have, and I look forward to seeing you in Weekly Python Exercise Newbie Edition.